Hello and welcome everyone! Nintendo just released an update for the Switch, which is uh, the update 11.0.0, which you can see over here. And if you want to update your Switch to this version, just click on System Update and it will search for it. But we're here to talk about the new picture transfer options. Because now you can transfer all your pictures either to a smart device, so like your smartphone or your TV or something, or to your PC. So, but we'll cover the smart device first. Let's say you want to copy over some of those pictures to your smartphone. Just click on one of the pictures. And now you want to push the A button for posting and editing. And there you'll have the option to send individually or send multiple images. So let's send multiple ones. Let's take the first 10 because it is limited to 10 pictures. Otherwise, you can select any more. Okay, okay. So we'll send. And now this will show up. And I have to say, this is not user-friendly. Because it's very, very complicated, but I will explain it to you. You want to push the plus button on your controller for trouble connecting, and then this will show up. Because now, the switch will be in your Wi-Fi network, and you can connect to it via the password. So we go to our smartphone, go into Settings, Connections, Wi-Fi, and now you will see your switch in the available networks. So we click on it, and we want to enter the password. So, looks alright, so we want to connect. And now it is connected, but it will tell you that the internet might not be available. But this won't matter. So now we press OK, and the switch recognizes it is connected to your smart device. And now you want to open up an app which can read QR codes, so I'm using Barco, and we'll click on this white round button at the top. And now we simply scan the QR code on the screen. And there you'll have all the pictures which you just shared, but uh, unfortunately in this app you can't save them. So I'll open them in my browser. And here you have them, now you can open them up and save them. Yeah, this way you can easily <laughs> copy over your pictures from your Switch to your smartphone. Well, I might still prefer using Twitter or something else to get your pictures over to your smartphone, but at least we have the option. And after you're done, make sure to reconnect to your normal Wi-Fi. But now we come to the more useful part of this update, and now we want to transfer our pictures to the PC. For that, you want to go to Data Management in the System Settings, Manage Screenshots and Videos, and click on Copy to PC via USB connection. For this one, you will need a USB Type-C cable, uh, which will look like this. Uh, this one came with the Pro Controller and the Switch Joy-Con charging grip, but most modern smartphones should also have a cable like that. And this cable you will simply plug into the bottom slot of your Switch and connect the USB port to your PC. So, and now we want to click on Copy to PC via USB connection and it will tell you that the Nintendo Switch is connected, and also on the Switch. So now it will show up in your Windows Explorer, Nintendo Switch, and there you can simply click on Album, and there you can simply copy over all the files you want. So let's copy them over to Switch Screenshots. And then it will look like this. And now we got everything. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, and I think that's already it. I hope this video was helpful for you, if so, please consider liking it, and I'll see you in the next one. So have a good day, morning, or evening, or a very good night. Bye! Oh, and simply click Disconnect on the Switch, and now you're back into the Switch.